Hello again from EVE Online Alliance Tournament 10. I'm Kiltu here with Lazarus Tell Raven. We are about to watch uh, Suddenly Spaceships Fight Shadow Cartel. Uh, another really good mm -hmm. match, hopefully. What do you think of what we are looking at on the field, Lazarus? Well, first let me clarify, I was corrected by Nolia on the forums that the, that Proteus set up last match, which is not the drone subsystem, but the Dissolution Sequencer subsystem. There but back to this match, uh, we had two Paladins from uh, Suddenly Spaceships, which we have not seen any Paladins yet this, uh, ma this tournament. Yeah, oh my gosh, Paladins. Yeah. Paladins, um, I haven't really seen them much on TQ either, so <laughs> uh, they, they are Marauder, so I mean, they do get the uh, rep amount bonus and 5% uh, large energy turret damage per level. Um, but then we have Taluses. They don't have a logistic ship. Uh, they've got Ishkers and Molluses. I'm not sure what we're going to see here. Maybe ASB Taluses again? I mean, they're at zero on the beacon, whereas you have uh, suddenly spaceships at range. Yeah, this is the most aggressive setup I think we've seen so far. Four Talos, two Brudix. Uh, all blasters right in your face. They all warp to zero at the beacon. We're underway now. looks like they're going to try and take a paladin out to begin with. That's pretty brave. I think if I were them, I might have gone for the oracles since they're going to be a little flimsier. But geez, look how much damage that paladin's taking. Yeah, he's just dying so quick with those neutrons. Up oh, first, Talos Whoa, just died. Oh, Talos I mean, down already. I, I didn't see many shield boosts. I mean, maybe. Whoa. <laughs> yeah, I mean, <laughs> so wow, much Seldarine. damage on both sides here. Seldarine's down in the paladin. I mean, you get these neutron blasters from these Taloses. Uh, Talos's uh, tier 3 battle cruiser has the large turrets. I mean, Tons of DPS uh, from the Taluses and a lot, of, a lot of DPS from the lasers. Um, wow, this is like the coolest match ever. The the Taluses really strong, tons of damage. There's a web, you know, they have the Loki there for the long range webs. Paladins have really really strong web. Wow. They have the Vindicator web bonus. The second Paladin down, uh, just two Oracles guard. It's amazing that with a Guardian and two Paladins, they weren't able to tank longer than that. That's yeah. just crazy. Because I mean, you had uh, you had three Taluses, I believe, go against the Suddenly Spaceships team's Vindicator last or in the in the six mans, and th they were even those Taluses weren't were able to break the tank on the Vindicator. But yet you have these Paladins just getting torn apart. As you see, the Oracle yeah, and structure. Oracle, Oracle about to go down. Another Talos yeah. down. So we have one Talos left, and the Oracle oh just died. Oh, man, so. this is a crazy match. Yeah, this is a really good Slugfest. <laughs> the best type of match, honestly. This is the most extreme. Like uh, We haven't seen a match that's this straightforward <laughs> in your face. Brawl, kind of another Oracle down kind of set up like, at all in this tournament. I haven't seen one in the last couple tournaments that's quite as in your face as four Talos, two Brudix. Yeah, this is this is a really fun setup. Um, the I mean, you get the Blaster Brudixes, you get the Ishkurs with the damage runs, and the Molluses looks like maybe the Molluses are fitting ECM, maybe? No, the ECM uh, will be from uh, ECM drones, probably from the I'm, Brudixes but we're only and, seeing, and from the Taluses. We're only seeing one. Oh, never, never. we got a second damp now on the Legion. Um, Wow, I just th those Talos are down, one Talos left, Ishkurs are starting to take some damage as the Guardian just dies. Wow, this is just a in-your-face, as Michael Bolton put it, uh, ba uh, backyard fight in, the, in a dark alley. alley. So, so the uh, the Talos, the remaining Talos for the Shadow Cartel team, damage slowed down on him. I think he had burned out of range. Uh, I guess there's not a whole lot of damage left is well, part of the problem. There's just nothing yeah. left to hit him. Uh, right. They're they're burning support down now. Punishers all in low armor. At the same time, they're trying to trade back. They got an Ishker low on the Shadow Cartel side. Jeez. Yeah, those those paladins just died so quickly. I can't believe they didn't take longer. Like I said, the Vindicator led in the six mans where it was able to actually tank some damage, but these paladins just get obliterated. Yeah, yeah. With like you said, they have they have extremely high resist from being marauders. Mm -hmm. They have a rep bonus with the local tank, and they mm -hmm. have a guardian supporting them. Almost all the frigs dead for suddenly spaceships now. Shadow Cartel is going to take this, running four Talos, two Brudix, and a Loki. It's such a cool setup, although yeah. that Talos is going to drop. But yeah. it's going to be too little too late, even just the support left on the field. I mean, there's still two yeah. Battlecruisers and a Tech 3, uh, basically just against the Legion now. And that Legion is probably a Link Legion and won't even do very mm -hmm. much damage. Well, so. they do have the Brudixes. They do have the Ishkers left uh, for DPS. Um, Shadow Cartel did lose their first match because they had a disconnected Proteus. Uh, so they lost it because of the losing that key ship in their setup. Um, as one of the ish cards looks like it did do, did die on the Shadow Cartel side, but uh, in the second match, Shadow Cartel did have a strong showing. Um, I think this is a uh, one of the might be one of the dark horses of the tournament, Shadow Cartel. <laughs> Such a cool match. Yeah. I mean, I, it would have been so fun. I'd love to see this Talos team mm -hmm. run against a bunch of other setups. But like these Brudixes or Shield Brudixes, probably not even ASBs. Yeah, um, I don't think any of the ships were ASBs. I think they were actually. Yeah, the Taluses had no ASBs. Yeah, it's they just had full uh, gank. It's like full mm -hmm. mag stab tracking disruptor. Yeah, the Taluses actually had armor hardener effects on. Or not armor, but a uh, shield hardener. Yeah, yeah, shield hardeners, but mm -hmm. no ASPs. And yeah. that match is over. Suddenly, yeah. spaceships wiped off the field by this like completely in your face Galant team. So cool. We'll have to see what uh, Ravi and the rest of the guys in the studio think of this. So we'll go back there. I love blasters. Yeah. <laughs>